How are you? I'm Eric Looper from Peak Performance Chiropractic, and this is my buddy Dan. Um, we are going to be um, reviewing some low back stretches today so that you can perform these stretches at home. Oftentimes we teach patients stretches in the office, and by the time they get home or by the time uh, the next day rolls around, they've forgotten exactly what we've talked about. So we're going to talk about some stretches today to help bring some um, flexibility uh, into the lower back um, when the back is tight. So we're going to start off in a hands and knees position. The nice thing about this group, grouping of stretches is that if you are having trouble getting on the floor, you can do this on a bed or um, any type of elevated surface. Um, you're just gonna get on your hands and knees with your knees stacked underneath your hips and your hands stacked underneath your shoulders. The first part of the stretch is gonna be what we call a basic cat-cow stretch, which means that um, the cat part of the stretch is where we lift that low back and mid back up and make almost an arc or a rainbow while dropping the head down. You're gonna hold that stretch for about five or six seconds, and then you're gonna drop the belly down into the cow position, lifting the head up and looking forward to get some extension into the spine. We're gonna repeat that 10 repetitions up, 10 repetitions down, breathing um, through, the, through the change of position, inhaling and outhaling, or exhaling. Um, just uh, just gently. You're gonna repeat that 10 times up, 10 times down, holding that uh, stretch for about a five second count. This shouldn't feel uh, strenuous to you. If you start feeling serious pressure in your low back, just stop that. Um, once you do that about 10 times, we're gonna sink back into what's called a child's pose, which really means just sinking your butt back toward your heels and then reaching your hands forward, almost trying to let the chest sink down toward your knees. This is gonna help really stretch out the lower part of the lumbar spine. It'll also give a good stretch to the shoulders and some other elements as well. You're gonna hold this child's pose for about 20 seconds. Um, when that's done, you're gonna just creep your hands to the left a little bit. That's gonna give a stretch, almost a lateral bending stretch uh, to the spine, as well as stretch out those, those lats um, you're going to hold that for about 20 seconds and then you'll creep the hands to the right side and hold that stretch for about 20 seconds. Um, when that's done, you're all done with your stretch routine and you can come on up and we're done. Thanks so much for watching. We'll see you soon.